Lacken Salmon Tacos. Guac is looking good. Taco time every day. So I gotta be honest, I don't care if it's Taco Tuesday or Taco Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. Just give me some tacos. And I love myself some fish tacos. That's my favorite kind of tacos. But instead of doing your classic white fish taco, I decided to branch out of the box and do a salmon taco with a delicious chili lime rub, fresh guacamole, and a little bit of shaved cucumber on the top. It's fresh, it's simple, it's delicious. Let's go. Okay, so I have a beautiful piece of salmon here and I'm going to cover it in a wonderful chili lime rub. So I have some chili powder here and this is chili as in C-H-I-L-I, -I, not E at the end, meaning it's a spice blend used to make like chili, the soup. Okay, so then we have onion powder. <laughs> onion powder and garlic powder look like almost the same thing, so when I have them in little bowls, you just never know. And then I have some, yes, garlic powder. Oh, it really got stuck in my little bowls. So then I'm going to add in some lime zest and some lime juice. So I have a microplane here. You can also use a cheese grater, just the fine setting. And you're just going to remove the top layer, the green part of the lime, which is the zest. And now it's time for the juice. Last part, just a little bit of olive oil to loosen things up. And then you're gonna go ahead and mix things together and then you're gonna take a brush, a basting brush, and just brush the salmon with the rub. Our salmon is painted to a tee, and now it's time to make my favorite guac recipe, and it all starts with, duh, avocados. So I have two avocados here, and I'm gonna add to it some diced up tomatoes, got some fun green tomatoes that actually have like a pepperminty taste. It's kind of cool. I'm gonna add all of those in. I have some diced up red onion and some jalapeno here. You don't need to add the jalapeno in if you don't want any heat, just leave it off. I have a little bit of smoked paprika and this is the secret ingredient in this. This just adds, you know, as you can imagine, a little bit of smokiness without being overwhelming, just another dimension. And then I'm gonna add in a full lime. So now I'm just gonna take a fork and I'm gonna mash up the avocado and stir in the ingredients and you can make the guac as chunky as you want. I like it pretty chunky, so that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, our guac is looking good. I'm gonna go ahead, set that aside and pop my salmon in the oven at 450 for about 16-ish minutes, meh, 15 to 18 minutes, depending on the thickness of your salmon. See you then. Our oven is doing some weird cooling cycle right now, but I can't wait any longer because my salmon's out of the oven and it's time to assemble these tacos. Let's get started. Blackened salmon tacos. It's bite time. Taco time every day. Mm. The salmon, the rub on it brings everything together. It gives that little Mexican flair. Oh, so fresh. So delicious. Check these out on tastefullygrace.com. You won't regret it. Ooh, how do I reach over without my sleeves getting? <laughs> 